Hello guys, uh, not way sir. This is gonna be a follow up on the YouTube video that I did. And yes, if you're looking at the screen right now, no surprise really. I mean, look at my subscribe <laughs> numbers. Yeah, so as of February 20th, 2018, yes, the channel will be demonetized. So, you might be thinking for some, is that gonna affect my channel? And I did say this before, so I'm gonna say it again. No, it will not. Because what I'm doing here, I may treat it seriously like a job, but it's a hobby to some extent. I would love to make money out of it. I would like to make it to a job, personal opinion only. But, you know, reality check, man. You know, what I'm doing really is, it's no different than other people. I mean, I just, I'm just keeping it real here. So, yeah, no surprise really, because they did start this channel, the main channel, June 23rd, 2008, believe it or not. I put up a first video, basically, because I didn't know what I was going to do on YouTube. Like, how do, I, how do I make a video? What do I do? And like I said, I got inspiration from people who does classic Let's Play. Some people I knew, uh, Tenga, Airstock Ryan, they were doing it. So I, I got an idea. I said, all right, do research, find some tools to record gameplay and upload it, and there you go. And then from time to time, I want to make it better had better tools quote unquote on it and there you go but still I was still doing it still for fun and it's the funny thing believe me or not and it doesn't matter it's a lot of the people who actually come in my video really is that some of them actually like took upon an interest in my channel basically we said you know what your channel is interesting because technically I don't do copycat I don't do political issue like that's one of my policy rules it's basically all original, you know, as in my own composition, of course, granted that the video itself, because, you know, it's copyrighted material, but you get the idea. Some of them basically also said, you know, it kind of sucked that you got, you know, this is like looks interesting. Hey, look, you're doing original idea and people don't subscribe to you. How come? And all I can say to that is just those are the works, you know, hey, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> I'm not complaining. That's how, that's the world. Even in 2008, that's, welcome to YouTube, that's what it is. Just because you put a video doesn't necessarily mean people will follow you. You have to stand out, like a lot of people, like Boogie said, like Review Tech USA said, Maximilian. And then you got to have to prove yourself. In order to do that, that takes time and dedication, maybe even go beyond beyond the borders of what you can do, beyond your limits, let's just say. And a lot of these people I just mentioned, they have done that. And I, uh, probably not so much. Uh, it's just my personality, per se. But, yeah, you know, it is what it is, like I said. Uh, yeah, I've been starting this, but like I said, my focus wasn't to get subscribed in the beginning, to tell the truth. <laughs> Believe me. The reason I did it, because I like making videos and just... There was a platform I could share it, and there you go. I would even put it to Rever at one point. Believe it or not, Rever, they shut down. Blimp, they shut down. Right now, I'm using also an alternative, uh, Daily Motion and Vimeo. Uh, for that reason, only exclusive to my MMG is Extend, the Mega Mix Game Shock is Extend, which is basically an extended gameplay of the game I already played. I really don't want to, well, probably not the good, best idea to put it, like just on the YouTube. And then spam your subscriber list about it. Because the whole point of the Making Miss Game Showcase, the main channel is, to put various games from past, present, and perhaps future for informative reason. That's the MO, believe it or not. Secondary, there's entertainment. So you kind of like, wait a minute, I thought YouTube is entertainment. Yes, it is. But my channel, the main one, is to help maybe for newcomers to say, oh, what is this game? What is this classic game? That's why you noticed in the beginning, I've been putting a lot of retro because I got the idea for Virtual Console. I wanted that to be like some focus so some of the newer, the newer gamers who started maybe the PlayStation, the PS2, who are interested in the video game say, oh, this is where it started in the 90s, Super Mario Brothers, The Legend of Zelda. And I wasn't intention to make money out of it. It's just, like, Review Tech USA in one of his videos he did, it was, yes, in 2013, what happened, what YouTube basically did, anybody can just monetize the video. The new thing is to sign up in a network. Yes, in the past, before that, you had to prove yourself to be a YouTube partner. You got to prove what, what makes you a YouTube partner, what makes it big. But after a while, they came in the MCN, multi-channel net, or MCN, multi-channel network, or private network, or whatever. And 
There you go. And believe it or not, uh, a lot of people have said this. And, uh, when we, believe me or not, here they're like, <laughs> there have been some network that did say, hey, you know, you guys potential. Would you ever consider? I decline. Why? Uh, like I said, there's a good thing, there are bad things, there's a requirement. And like I said, that as of right now, at the time, I just just doing it for fun because really, like I said. It's not really that original. It's more like if you watch G for Cinema Tech. That's all it is. It's just my version of Cinema Tech. It's just basically me playing, so it's my style. But again, like I said, the ammo there is to be informative. Then entertainment comes in second. Monetizing was just something. Okay, you know, why not make also money inside? Because I, you know, I got a, I got a day job. Some people do. I mean, Pixel Dan basically got props. He even said he's doing because he loves what he's doing. And he gets, you know, he's part of a group from what I heard, but he also has a day job. Some of those big YouTubers, believe it or not, have day job. Uh, the one I'm going to say, the part time I had in school, he talks about Dragon Ball anime. His name is Anime Live Reaction. Uh, if I do remember, I'll put those links in the box, description box, about it. And yeah, he has a day job, but he does this anime theories because he loves to do. Same goes. So some people, yeah, it's a full-time job like Review Tech USA, Angry Joe, PewDiePie, Total Biscuit. Uh, I'm not gonna mention one name because the guy's a jerk. You know, I just, you know, I mean, if you don't, uh, he just did something stupid a couple of weeks ago. Let's just say that. And yes, it's a he, and it's he's American. If you know what I mean. So anyway, <laughs> apologies for that one. Yeah. So. But to me, okay, so to me personally, yeah, it's not going to affect the channel, even demonetize. I'm still going to do it because I enjoy what I'm doing, so don't worry about it. Hey, at least the good news there, not for some who are offended with ads. Hey, guess what? No more ads, right? No more ads. Because I, I, I don't have the option anymore. So, I mean, you know, ads are good and bad. It's a necessary evil, blah, 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 blah. So... Yeah, so the bottom line really is, is that, yes, even past February 28th, 2018, the channel's going to still be up, I'll be supporting, I'm still putting up more videos on it, because my goal on the main channel is to put as many different variety of video games I can put on, that I can think of, and I have a long way, I still have a long way, believe me or not, with new releases. Classic game revives, etc., etc. And plus, I'm still going to give my opinion. And, and remember, my second channel don't longer even monetize anymore. So, again, you know, so it doesn't really matter. So, there you go. But the good news really is for even if your video get demonetized or you're not a you quote unquote YouTube partner, I'm still able to put thumbnail, and that's all I really care thumbnails and, and video links. Kind of, I'm doing lately now with those videos, if you notice. So, that's all I really care. Monetizing, yeah, it's a loss, but it is what it is. I can't do anything about it. Like I said, there are other ways if you need to make money somehow. Like I said, I know but people say, why not do a Patreon? I'm like, yeah, you know, like I said, it's just a hobby. I got a day job that I got to focus on. Uh, so don't worry about it. Hey, you know, my point is, again, it's not going to affect me. It's all about me trying to help the gaming community. To know more about video games, I know that's really it. So yeah. Ah, so again, so one last time recap. Even it gets monetized on February twentieth, Mega Mix Game Showcase and its secondary channel, the MMGS V Blockmer Spot, will still be going. That's really it. Uh so nothing to worry there. Don't worry about it. So with that, uh yeah, thanks for listening.